Hi guys, welcome to the first video of the Unreal Engine tutorial series. In this one I will show you how to create your custom MetaHuman as a playable character. So go ahead and open your Unreal Engine. Uh, I'm using version 5.4, so if you don't have that one yet, just download it. Uh, there's few things that changed in MetaHumans especially as well, so I definitely recommend doing that now. Um, for your project name, I'm going to call this Sword and Shield. Uh, you leave it on blueprints uh, and create a third person template. After the project is created, press Ctrl and Space, go to the third person, blueprints, and BP third person character is going to be our main character. You can dock it up here. I'd also recommend renaming it to player underscore BP for blueprint. Uh, now click on a quickly add to project, quick soul bridge, go to your metahumans, my metahumans, and you can just download and add the one you created. I already downloaded mine, so I just need to add it to the project. And once that's done, uh, you go to metahumans. MetaHuman you created, mine is named Shadow, so I open BP Shadow. If you get these missing plug plugins, just enable them all. And yeah, maybe restart the Unreal Engine. Now we're back, we got MetaHuman downloaded, so we open it again and then we need to copy all the body parts from the metahuman into our player character so everything apart from body so we go to feet, legs, torso, face you can also copy LOD sync control C control V so we got LOD sync, these four Feet, face, toes, and legs. You need to make a child of the character mesh. So you copy it under. Then go back, copy the rest of it. Eyelashes, fuzz, eyebrows, hair, mustache, and beard. Control C. Uh, so it doesn't add it as a children of the feet of the face, but we can just add it manually. Cool. Now we got all the body parts copy it to the new character but as you can see we can still see Unreal Engine Mesh so we go to BP Shadow again go to body uh, find out where this body is located the skeletal mesh asset click on it go back to player go to mesh and just click here I will copy the same body that we have now what we need to do is get a torso leg, legs feet and face as well and reset the locations. Cool. Now, only thing is missing, you can see a few things under the line. Um, so now what we need to do is go to construction script. We type set leader post component mesh. So that's the character mesh. If you created the wrong one, you can just still delete it as well, copy it from here, from the character mesh, set it as the leader, and then you get all the rest of them again, so torso, legs, feet, and face. And you put it in target. So what it does is, it sets mesh, character mesh as a leader, and rest of it will be attached to it. So now when we compile, save all uh, we can see in the viewport the yoga pans are fixed now uh, another issue we're having is you can maybe see that hair is a little bit flickering as well uh, you go to LOD sync and in the LODs on forced LOD you put it on zero now we'll fix the hair issue uh, another thing you can still see the flip flops as well obviously in RPG game we don't want to have a flip flops on so what we do is go to fit, find the visibility, 
and unclick it as a invisible. Now, if you compile and save all, you technically could have a playable character as well. Now he's gonna do a little booty shake. Booty, 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 booty. So, what we need to do now is go to mesh again. Character mesh. Um, first, anim class, if you're having a male character, just set it as ABP money. ABP queen is for ladies. Compile and save, then search for the ABP money. We open it. Uh, and now we need to go to the anim graph. Anim graph is here. If you don't have it open, uh, just go to my blueprints and double click on anim graph that will open it up. Uh, go to control rig and then control rig here on the bottom, full body IK. Instead of root as a pelvis, we change it to animation root. Compile it and save it. Go to back to money. We close this up. Don't need this anymore. Play the game. And you got meta human. All the controls as well. Everything you wanted. Cool. That's it for this video. See you in the next one.